A uh, lot of credit to uh, the Steelers. Um, good football team. Uh, came in today. Uh, extremely um, well prepared and ready to go. Uh, we didn't do a great job, and that starts with me. Uh, and um, our preparation, uh, I thought we were ready. We didn't go out and execute today in uh, so many different fashions. Uh, one starting with the uh, defense with our run fits, you know, uh, 157 yards rushing, uh, definitely not good enough. Uh, on the offensive side of the ball, we couldn't create any momentum, um, didn't establish the run game at all. Um, we got to do a much better job in our protection and giving, giving Sam an opportunity to be able to go through his progression and get down the field. Uh, third down was uh, horrendous, to say the least, uh, on both sides. You know, they were four, we were four of 11. Uh, and then, you know, they were 12 of 16. So uh, not good enough in regards to affecting time of possession, which they had 36 minutes uh, to our 23. And it all results with that. So um, it's nothing we can do about uh, this game. Uh, this is behind us. Uh, we're off tomorrow. We're back in here on Tuesday, uh, getting ready for Detroit. And with that, I take your questions. Steve, Steve, why do you think you weren't able to establish the run today? You guys have been running the ball so well. Well, uh, I got to watch the tape. You know, uh, our level, you know, they were, they were stout up front. They did a lot of movement. Uh, the linebackers did a good job playing down the hill. Uh, but in the end resort, I got to see the tape. Steve, it looked like C.J. Henderson throughout, throughout his time on the sideline was trying to get back in and kind of warm up. What, what happened with the injury? What's his status as of right now? Uh, don't really know his status moving forward. It is an ankle. Um, and, you know, with that, next man up. And uh, keep got to go out there and perform. Got to make plays. In previous games, the Panthers have kind of set the tone phys with physicality. And it seemed like today the Steelers were able to do that to you guys. Did you notice the same thing? And why do you think that was? Um, I put it on me. You know, didn't have the guys ready and prepared. You know, that's my fault. And I agree with the statement. You know, they they were more physical than us today, which is not uh, it's not our mantra. It's not us. Did you have any other options besides Key? Uh, it seemed like they were really picking on. Did you consider T.J. Carey, for instance? Uh, you know, uh, Key got to make plays. You know, uh, whoever's in there, T.J. Carey, uh, you know, Keith Taylor, uh, whoever it may be, they got to make plays. Given. Uh, that you really couldn't run the ball. You kept trying to run the ball a couple of times inside the five late. Did you just feel like that's your identity and stick to it? No, we mixed it up. Um, you know, we, we ran the ball and we felt like we had an opportunity based off the look and the personnel that was in the game. Uh, and then we took our shot right there. And again, they had pressure a couple of times and we got to do a much better job. Again, protecting Sam and allowing him to go through his progression. From a play calling standpoint, where do you think you guys came up short? Um, play calling could have been better. Execution by the players could have been better. Uh, you know, better uh, organization and structure by uh, the head coach could have been better. So we all got a hand in this. It's not just one player, one person, one coach. When you talk about the playoff picture and earlier this week, you said you wanted the team to focus on us. How do you feel as though that focus was maintained, if at all, up to the game? Uh, I, I thought the focus was fine. You know, the execution did not prevail. And uh, still not worrying about it last week, not worrying about it now. We've got to worry about trying to get ourselves right to win a football game. So uh, I don't want anybody in this in this building talking playoffs. Does Sam, does you go, does Sam play well enough to be the quarterback moving forward? Say that again? Does Sam play well enough to, to be the quarterback in the last three games? We're going to watch the tape and, and evaluate everybody. When you look at uh, the, the first drive of the second half, 11 minutes, 43 seconds, 21 plays, 91 yards, is that the type of uh, drive that you want to show to your defense to show where everything has gone better since that drive did take so long and took up a huge chunk of the what, what, what we're going to do with that drive, we're going to pull out all the third downs out. All right? That's what we went wrong. And that's what I just mentioned right here earlier. We didn't execute on third down. You know, we had you know, what I consider a couple of times the, the right call. We just got to execute and finish. Steve was. Got to tackle. Coach, you were fairly successful spreading Darnold out in the, in the successful games you had. He was in the pocket a lot more today and vulnerable. Do um, you think that's something that you might explore? Well, it's something that we talked about and something that we did, you know, um, throughout the game a little bit. Maybe we could have done it a little bit more. You know, I, I'm not saying that was the answer. Um, whether we drop back or whether we sprint out, we got to protect.
What happened on the uh, penalty, the personal foul penalty before the fourth quarter? Uh, I don't, I don't know exactly which one you're talking the, about. The the personal foul, uh, the, the DB from from Pittsburgh. What happened? Uh, he said something, and they called the um, the penalty on him. We got the first down. What he said, I don't know. I wasn't on the field. Did any of the uh, sacks was, were they the result of Sam holding it too long? Um, Got to look at the tape, you know, uh, and, and see exactly uh, what happened. You know, a couple of times, guy came off the field and said it was my my bad. So I assume it was the lineman on that one particular thing. But as you look at the tape, it could have been as well. Sam holding on to the ball. We have to see. And was CJ ruled out? Uh, CJ and was ruled out. Were you disappointed by the amount of Pittsburgh Steelers fans that were in the stands? You know, I was focused uh, on the game. You know, really didn't pay attention to it. Once I get uh, in the mindset of, of, of game like, I'm not affected by it. How do you kind of where do you go from here? You all had some pretty good momentum, and today felt like at least you know a bit of a step back. Well, and again, we got to hit the reset button. You know, don't allow it to get in the way. You know, we've been down this road before. You know, that was a setback against Cincinnati. We came back the next week, played a great game against Atlanta. So uh, we got to find a way as coaches in the in the men in the locker room. All right, to make plays, and we got to do a much better job putting them in position to make plays. And why the day off tomorrow? All right, because of the short week. Everybody good? Thank you, Coach.